Well, what we're doing today is we're organizing a human graph mm. to illustrate um, the safe upper limit of carbon dioxide in our atmosphere at 350 parts per million. Mm. We're currently at 389, so we're trying to try and gather townspeople from Carl's Corona to create a human graph illustrating where we need the, uh, the concentration of carbon dioxide to go. We're out here to rally the troops, get people involved, and uh, I think they are. I think, they're, I think they're up for it. Cool, good luck, sir. Thanks very much, see you. So we just create an action, come here to remind people that it's really important for us to get into action to reduce the emission of CO2 to protect our Earth. I mean, there's so many people here, we just kind of walked around and, and everybody seemed to be pretty enthused. Yeah, it's great, there's an awesome turnout. Around the world today, there are um, a huge number of events. 5,200 events happening across the world in 180 countries. It's huge, it's really, really big, so keep that in mind today. This might be just kind of one small place where, you know, it's one community coming together, but if people here are doing this, and people um, all over Sweden are doing this, and people all over the world are doing this, it's a huge and powerful message that comes together. Maybe that cause huge, huge changes, but if it happens on many places, many times, more and more people will think more and more about it. It was six weeks to Copenhagen. This awareness and actions like these is what we need to make a binding agreement. people about it and get them up here. I don't know if they all came up here, but I had a lot of great conversations and a lot of people were were, were pretty pumped that this was going to be on the internet and, and a part of 5,000 other events that are going on. Well, it's difficult to get the message across in like, you know, a few seconds of trying to recruit people. But um, yeah, I mean, people seem keen and then I think through this they'll start to learn more and maybe take something home and think about it a bit more. I think it's sowed a little seed about about what's going on here and they can look onto the internet. I mean, it makes me think one more time now about the, the CO2 emissions and yeah, what, what it actually, what effect it can actually have. Climate change is a major issue right now and I know that this concerted effort is a really good opportunity for people to show the world leaders in Copenhagen um, this December that people are ready for change and we need to make um, some serious commitments to reducing carbon emissions. I think it gives a huge sense of hope and also of momentum and a really loud voice to our world leaders today um, based on how many people have come out all around the world. If it was enough of us having these conversations, we can make a positive difference. So, pretty incredible. Pretty inspirational day. <laughs>